Thank you for watching this overview of Raw Power for iOS. Raw Power lets you edit RAWs, organize your photo library, and synchronize your changes to iCloud. This is the album view. The first section is Recents, starting with an album of recently viewed images. Images that you have recently edited, shared, or just viewed for several seconds are automatically placed in this album. It also remembers albums that you have recently looked at. Next are the built-in system albums, followed by the albums that you have created yourself. At the top of the screen is a menu with help and other information. Next to that is a plus button to create albums. On the right of the screen is a select button. Tap that to select albums to rename or delete. You cannot delete or rename built-in albums. Tap the magnifying glass to search for albums by name. Tap on an album to view the photo grid. As you scroll, you will get a date overlay to help you navigate. In addition, you can change the direction of sorting to be either newest first or oldest first. You can also tap the select button to pick images to share, remove from the album, or delete from the library. Deleted images are still available in the built-in Photos app for 30 days afterward. Tap the button in the upper left to display the inspector. This gives you quick access to all your albums without returning to the album view. You can position the inspector on either side of the screen by dragging it by one of the titles at the top of the inspector. I'll tap on an album to switch to it and then create a new album. The new album is created and placed in the Recent section automatically. To add images to the new album, use iOS 11 drag and drop. First, tap and hold on an image and move it slightly. This starts the drag gesture. While keeping the image held, tap additional images with your other fingers. Then drag the collection to the album. This album is not just available in raw power. It has been added to the iOS photo library. If you use iCloud photo library, it will also be synced through iCloud to your other devices, including the Mac. Tap on an image to go to the OneUp Photo View. In the OneUp View, you can view metadata about the photo, including file name, file type, flash status, shooting information, and camera. You can also get a map if the image has GPS information. This next image is a RAW. You can tap the Edit or Adjust button to bring up RAW Power's editing tools. In the upper left corner is a menu with commands to rotate and flip, reset adjustments, and copy and paste adjustments between images. There is also a help system with information on each adjustment. Raw Power for iOS has all the same adjustments as in Raw Power for the Mac, including Crop, Raw Processing, which gives you incredible control over Apple's Raw Engine, White Balance with a Sampler, Tone and other basic controls, a powerful curve, and a high-quality sharpener. In the next video, we'll go into detail about Raw Power's editing tools.